Malolo Estate, situated outside Port Moresby, like so many other places in the nation's capital, has continuously suffered from developments taking place. Residents at the Malolo Estate Stage 2 have waited so long for assistance after so many letters and emails to the National Superannuation Fund, who is the original proprietor of the estate. We've been patients long enough and it's our rights, again as taxpayers and citizens, and this is a uh, urban uh, suburb, it's not a uh, settlement or a village. So we thought that, you know, let, let's be professionals. And so we're taking this approach to MTV in order that uh, we want the place, uh, you know, uh, the problem to be uh, fixed. The road leading into residential houses in the area has experienced flooding during heavy downpours and continuous running of water from a natural spring which was diverted by development to the area is eating away the bitumen road. Longtime resident Raj Ralavurai said the problem has been going on for almost five years and although the community has received some feedback from the relevant authority, nothing has been done. We must have a couple of hundred emails. We've done uh, emails backwards and forwards. We've taken all of the photographs, pictures of the damage of things, and that's been reported to to uh, Nas Fund um, two years ago plus. And we've had no real uh, uh, response. Residents are concerned as the continuous running of water is a health hazard for their families. Homeowners who have put their houses on rent are losing clients and vehicle owners are also concerned as getting in and out of their driveway is becoming a problem. Residents are requesting a better drainage system for the area to relieve them of the continuous flooding and flowing water and say that a response from authorities and quick action would be appreciated. Judith Kasek, National MTV News.